55th Grammys have a pretty strict dress code, which is kind of unexpected because usually at the Grammys you see a little bit of nudity, you see some pretty outrageous uh, attire. Uh, but the CBS has put out a fashion advisory uh, to let everyone know, or a wardrobe advisory, to ever, let everyone know that they need to dress appropriately. So here are the rules. Please be sure the buttocks and female <laughs> breasts are adequately covered. Thong type costumes are problematic. Please avoid exposing bare, fleshy undercurves of the buttocks yeah. and butt crack. <laughs> the so, buttock crack, I've never heard that before. <laughs> so it was a very, I guess, eloquent way of putting everything, and then at the very end you have the word butt crack. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's hilarious. Now, they're in a tight spot, right? Because they're on TV and they got to worry about all these mm -hmm. rules, etc. And so they're going to tell people to watch their buttock crack. Right. Right? But then, you know, you look ridiculous. This sounds absurd. So they're like, watch the side boob, watch the under boob, watch the ass, watch everything. I think that side boob can be tasteful. I agree. Okay. I agree and I encourage. I'm, but I'm not, I'm not joking. Side boob can be tasteful. There are some gowns that show a little tiny bit of side boob and it looks beautiful. Under boob is rarely tasteful. It's usually very trashy looking. So I'm in I, I'm favor of- I'm surprised under boob hasn't caught on. I am like, not I thought a fan it was going to catch on like wildfire, right? I'm still waiting. I'm still waiting. I, I believe. All I right. believe in the underboob. All right. Well, don't hold your breath, but okay. okay. But the side boob has really made strides. Now, everybody's side boobing away. Yes. Like, yes. you're kind of unhip if you haven't showed the side of your boob, mm -hmm. right? In fact, I was seeing a dress where I would show some side. Please don't. <laughs> don't do that. But, but the Grammys, unfortunately, have put this thing out, so I can't. No, so I'm not allowed. The hilarity <laughs> continues, okay? There's more to this advisory. Please av avoid sheer see-through clothing that could possibly expose female breast nipples. Because, you know, there are nipples on other parts of the body, so they want to be clear that they're talking about breast nipples. Oh, right? I see, instead of elbow nipples. <laughs> yeah. And by the way, male breast nipples apparently totally fine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Please be sure the genital region or the crotchal region is adequately covered so that there is no visible puffy bare skin exposure. Oh. Puffy bare skin exposure? Oh, yeah. The person who wrote this note was either incredibly embarrassed or incredibly amused. Or like Todd Aiken, <laughs> who's like a little unaware of anatomy. You know, he's like, is it puffy down there? Like, how does that work? <laughs> <laughs> All I know is that you should not expose the buttock crack. <laughs> so that's, that's what's going to happen at the Grammys. I, I'm sure some people are going to break the dress code. Yeah. Uh, no, 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 no. From what I understand, Lady Gaga is, if there's one thing we know about her, she follows the code, mm -hmm. okay? If somebody lays down a rule or regulation for Lady Gaga, you can bet your bottom dollar she will follow it. 